Welcome back to the channel everybody. This is an exciting day, another exciting day. Uh, if you would have watched the last video, you know the beast is home. So today is the first official cook having the beast at home. And I had these beautiful baby back ribs in the freezer. I took them out. They're all thawed out. We're going to just uh, prep them up real quick and get them on the smoker. I've got the smoker going already. It's up to about 240, 250. It fires nice. Uh, I'm just excited. So we're going to prep these guys real quick. There's nothing, nothing fancy you have to do. We are taking the silver skin off. So I'm going to get these all open and taken care of. And then we're going to put the rub on them. Got them all trimmed up, silver skins taken off. Uh, they look great. So I'm going to use my rub. I came up with this myself. It is black pepper, salt, garlic, and antro chili. Works awesome with the smoke, tastes great, not overpowering, and I just like it. So very liberally, we're going to coat each rib, both sides. I don't normally use binders. I find if you uh, put it on with the salt in there, leave it a few minutes, brings out a little bit of the water. It just sticks good anyway. So up to you. You can use binders if you want. I have nothing against them. I just don't use them really. There we go. Now let it sit for about five minutes. And then we're gonna go throw them in the smoker. But before we throw them in the smoker, I'm gonna just tell you, I'm gonna do it exactly the same way I have been doing ribs. So we're gonna throw them in for two hours, 225, 250. At the two hours, we'll check. If I like the color, we're gonna take them out wrap them up, use a little bit of butter, and then throw them back in hour, hour and a half, two hours to, till they're tender, and then take them out. Typically four hours, that's what I found uh, works well, gets you a really tender rib. Uh, it's been working for me so I've been doing it that way, and we're going to do it that exact same way today, and see how we do. in two hours the ribs look good we're gonna take them off we're gonna wrap them and then throw them back on okay they're all wrapped I eat what I did I melted some butter in the smoker smoked it for a little bit I don't know if it picked up any flavor anyways put the ribs on the butcher paper added some of the melted butter I just like what the butter does to the flavor just it's really good wrapped they're back on Gonna give them at least another hour, hour and a half at 225, 250. And then next time you see me, they're gonna be done and we're gonna be tasting them. They're done. Let's uh, take them out of the paper and uh, see what we've got. But using the butter, oh my God, it smells so good. how tender it is. They fall apart. With you after. Oh. Alright, look at that. It just falls off the bone. It's 
Still really hot, but that's okay. Yeah, like, see? It just comes off the bone. Oh, look at that. Perfect. That's so good. I like using the butter. Gives it a nice flavor. Great smoke ring. Look at that. It just falls off. That's oh, perfect. The first official cook in the Beast here at home. Total success. Those ribs are perfect the way I like them. Uh, yeah, I'm very happy about that. Hope you guys had fun. I'm just excited that this beast is home. Uh, I got lots of stuff planned for you guys. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go eat now. I'm hungry. Uh, see you soon. And happy eating.